Hello everyone, welcome to the 25th exercise of Autodex Fusion 360 Beginners tutorial. In this exercise, I am going to be showing you how to design this figure using Autodex Fusion 360. Here are the dimensions of the figure and the tools and commands I am going to use in this tutorial. If you are new to this channel, do subscribe to us and turn on the bell notification so that you won't miss any of our new videos. Now, without wasting time, let's get into it. First, create a new design by going to Files and select New Design. The unit we're gonna use in this tutorial is millimeter. Create a new sketch on the front plane. Draw a center dia circle from the origin of diameter 50 millimeter. Draw another concentric circle of dia 30 millimeter. Arrange these dimensions properly. Go to straight line command, make it construction and draw an inclined line from the origin at an angle of 135 degree with the positive x-axis having a length of 100 mm as follows. Turn off this construction feature. Under create, go to center dia circle again and draw a circle from this point of diameter 16 mm. Press L to go to line command. Select the first point of the line on this circle and the second point on this circle. Repeat the same step on the opposite side. Now under constraint go to tangent. Select this line and the circle. I don't need to make it tangent here because it is already tangent. Make the other line tangent to the remaining two circles. Now under create, go to slot, center to center slot. Select the first point of the slot on this point. Give it a length of 50 millimeter. The dia of slot will be 7 millimeter. Uncheck the show dimension option to view our sketch properly. Finish sketch. Go to extrude command. Select these profiles. Select this circular profile. Change the direction to symmetric and give it a distance of 75 mm. So the body will have a total distance of 150 mm. Click OK. Turn on the visibility of previous sketch. Go to extrude command again. This time select these two profiles carefully. Change the start type to offset and provide an offset distance of 45 mm. Extrude distance 10 mm. Here it is. Operation join and click OK. Hide sketch 1. Now I am going to mirror this body with respect to the front plane. So under create go to mirror. Change the mirror type to feature. I am going to mirror this extrude feature. So click it here. Mirror plane, this front plane. 
compute option adjust and click ok here it is moving to the next step create a new sketch on the right plane before drawing anything i am going to project this whole body on our current sketch so under create go to project change the selection filter to bodies select this body turn on the projection link and click ok our body has been projected properly press c to go to center dia circle command draw a circle from the origin of diameter 50 mm another concentric circle of diameter 30 mm go to straight line command draw a vertical line here of length 25 mm and keep drawing a horizontal line up to this circle repeat the same step on the other side hide our bodies to view our sketch properly under create go to sketch dimension command select this point and the origin and give a vertical distance in between them as 12.5 cm under constraint go to horizontal or vertical click on this line it is showing that the line is already horizontal that's it our sketch is almost ready so finish sketch turn on the visibility of bodies go to extrude command select this circular profile drag it outward up to a distance of 100 mm change the operation to join click okay here we have our new body we need to trim out this excess bodies from our figure so go to extrude command again turn on the visibility of sketch one select this inner circular profile drag it outward change the direction to symmetric so it will remove all the excess bodies symmetrically make the operation is selected as cut you can change the extent type to all but in this case it is not working properly so change the extent type to distance and drag it outward up to this much click okay hide sketch 1 and view sketch 2 go to extrude again select this inner circular profile drag it outward make sure the operation is selected as cut and click okay here is our body almost ready time for the upper part turn on the visibility of sketch 2 press e to go to extrude command select this profile change the start type to object select this surface as our object surface drag it inward up to minus 35 cm make sure the operation is join and click okay here you can see our body has been extruded from the object surface instead of the profile plane now i am going to mirror this body on the other side so under create go to mirror type features for the object select this extrude 
and for the mirror plane select the front plane here it is compute option adjust and click ok our body is almost ready under modify go to fillet select these edges and provide a fillet distance of 12.5 cm press enter hide sketch to press F to go to fillet again this time select these two edges provide a fillet distance of 2 cm under create go to hole command click on this surface drag our hole to the center of the arc for the reference you can also click on this arc so our hole will be placed at the center of the arc diameter 15 millimeter extend all so our hole will be created throughout the all body hole type simple drill point flat click ok the hole has been created successfully now it's time for the last part create a new offset plane from the top plane at a distance of 35 millimeter select this plane and create a new sketch on it go to center dia circle draw a circle from the origin of diameter 20 millimeter another concentric circle of diameter 10 millimeter finish sketch go to extrude command select this outer circle drag it downward up to this much that will be minus 15 millimeter operation join and click ok i need to create another hole here so turn on the visibility of sketch 3 go to extrude command again select this inner circular profile drag it downward up to this much that is minus 25 millimeter operation cut and click ok hide sketch 3 here is our figure ready we have successfully created the hole on the upper side it's time to provide some color press a to go to appearance i'm going to apply this paint metallic red color on it do some little bit changes on it and here it is ready thank you guys for watching this video if you guys have any suggestions and recommendations please let me know in the comment section see you in the next tutorial till then keep designing and design whatever you love. Bye-bye.